few tricks in order to get more work as a substitute teacher. Always put your name and your substitute code. In my district, it's my cell phone number. I always put that on the bottom of my teacher's reports. I put it nice and big and clear. I make sure that they can read that. I leave a simple business card with my teacher's report. That way, they can keep it in their wallet or their desk or they can put it by their phone at home and they say, we like this guy, he's a good substitute teacher. Or they can pass on my card if another teacher is going to be out. They can say, this substitute teacher is very organized, he even has a business card. I found that's a good way to stand out as a substitute teacher. Another way to stand out as a substitute teacher, always be on time. In fact, if you're on time, you're late. Be early. As a substitute teacher, you have a lot of extra responsibilities. Things like yard duty in elementary school. In middle school, you might be watching a hallway, watching the lockers, watching the, the students from being disruptive. Or you might be watching a bus stop, making sure that the students ru don't run across the street. Be there early so that you can check your lesson plans and you might have you might be assigned to yard duty or to a crosswalk be aware of this this will make the school secretaries very happy they will remember you school secretaries are incredibly important they are the ones that run the schools as much as i love the principals and the teachers the school secretaries are the ones that are the backbone of any school. They're the ones that run the day-to-day -day operation. Get to know them, be nice to them, be friendly. Give them one of your business cards. If you're running late, stuck in traffic, make sure and call the secretary. Make sure you have their number. There are times that there are traffic jams or accidents and you might be late. Just make them aware. It's not a big deal. There are people to cover the class but just make sure that they are aware. You'll look like a hero. I can't tell you how many times I've called the school secretary and said, I'm stuck in traffic. And they, they already know there's a traffic jam because everyone's showing up late. But they're so thankful that I've called them and taken the time to make sure that they're okay. And that way I am invited back over and over to that school. You probably also want the school secretary to have one of your business cards with your access code on it so that they can recommend you. Teachers will listen to the secretary. They'll, they might ask the secretary for a recommendation of a sub that they like. They will have a literal Rolodex, old school, of your phone number and they'll, and they'll request you for their classroom. Being requested in classroom makes your life a lot easier. The students already know you, they're excited to see you, the teacher knows you, you've probably left your card in a, in, a school, in a school or a classroom that you already like, so you're familiar and you like that class. Being familiar with the classroom, being familiar with the students makes your day much, much easier. At the end of the day, give a clear, concise report to the school principal. They do read your reports. They will take recommendations, but it's nice for them to know what's going on in the classrooms. They're very busy. They don't have time to check up on you. By making sure that the principal sees your report again, you're likely to be requested back to that school and that class.